Breaking Abstract 3, a plenary abstract, is the VERIFY trial, a phase 3 double-blind placebo-controlled trial of rusfertide for treatment of polycythemia vera. In patients with polycythemia vera, the standard of care is phlebotomy with or without cytoreductive drugs. In the VERIFY trial, patients who were phlebotomy dependent uh, with polycythemia vera and receiving standard of care uh, were randomized to the drug rusfertide versus placebo. The rusfertide was given once weekly, and it's a drug that targets the hepcidin pathway to control the hematocrit. The primary endpoint was the percent of patients with a clinical response, such as the absence of phlebotomy, and the percent with no phlebotomy in weeks 20 to 32. The results, 293 patients were enrolled. Uh, about half got concurrent cytoreductive therapy. The mean phlebotomy was significantly less with rusfertide, 0.5 versus 1.8 in the placebo arm. More patients maintained a hematocrit, less than 45% in the rusfertide arm, 62.6% versus only 14.4% in the placebo arm. And patient reported outcomes were better in the rusfertide arm, and promise fatigue scores were better with the rusfertide. Serious adverse events were 3.4% for the rusfertide versus 4.8% for the placebo arm. And we know that AML uh, and other malignancies uh, can occur in patients with polycythemia. Um, AML occurs in about 3% of these patients over 10 years. So they carefully looked at the development of new malignancies. There was one in the rusfertide arm and seven in the placebo arm. So it clearly did not increase and may, although not significant, have decreased the development of uh, AML. In conclusion, uh, this trial um, showed a reduction in the need for phlebotomy and improved hematocrit control in patients with polycythemia with better patient-reported outcomes, less fatigue, less need to go in for phlebotomy, and this really should become a new standard of care for patients who are requiring phlebotomy that have polycythemia.